We floated online, Sherry and I. I needed, needed a date to the VMAs and felt pretty cute. I don't know. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Pillow Time! <laughs> Same, but welcome to the show, babies. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to your favorite podcast. This is Pillow Talk. I'm your host, Ryan Pownall. We are co-hosted today, repeat offender by Amber Emery. Amber Emery. <laughs> <laughs> I would say Canada's queen of OnlyFans. You think so? You're the OG. You're Don't the say goat. that. That makes me sound old. You're a little old. <laughs> <laughs> what's your age? Excuse me? I said, what's your age? What's your age? I'm 34, guys. Oh, I know he's the MILF, the MILF king. I don't have any kids yet, You're not though. old enough yet. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm working my way up. And today, we are joined by the hottest person in the fucking industry. We're talking music. We're talking social media. We're talking sex. Young Gravy is on the show. <laughs> What an icon. What a legend. Young Gravy, you are on fucking fuego right now. Yeah, you are baby. hot. Thank you, baby. You're in the tabloids more than the Biebs, Leo DeCap. Apparently. Denzel, yeah. The Rock. Young Gravy got him beat. Uh, supposedly. Fucking Leo banana DiCaprio salad. and him are complete opposites. Who would you fuck? Obviously him. You've been trying to fuck him. I'm, a, I'm 34. How am I going <laughs> to fuck Leonardo DiCaprio? <laughs> <laughs> Respect. <laughs> respect, respect, respect. No, so uh, Young Gravy a couple weeks ago, of course, everybody knows this, everyone in the room. If you don't, then you're dumb. He brought Addison and Ray's mom to the VMAs. They kissed on stage. And apparently now in the tabloids, they went home and actually did fuck. It was not a PR stunt. That's what they're saying. So we would like to ask you about that. Did you guys make the sucky fucky? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I've been seeing, like, posts about, oh, she's pregnant, all this, oh, you know. Shit. Again. People just like to have, you know, people like attention. You know, I, I, I have no comment. No comment. We hung out, had a great first date. Wow. Iconic right. first date. <laughs> it was great. It was great. Like, I think the most famous first date ever was Bieber Selena. They, he took her to a, a stadium to watch the Titanic at, at the Staples Center. You crushed that shit. Biebs, step it up. Young Gravy's on fire. <laughs> But let's talk about this MILF thing. So obviously that's your whole thing, and it blew up, and it's genius. You know, it's like Finch from American Pie, but we're talking 30 years later, and you're just taking it and running with it. Is it real? People want to know, do you actually love fucking MILFs, or is it banana sandwich? I'll fuck a MILF. <laughs> but okay. are, are you still going to put it down with, like, my girl Liz over there? Yes. Okay, so... <laughs> <laughs> He's a man of many tastes. Okay, so it's not Variety like exclusive. Because people are really exclusive. I actually I was exposed not long ago via sex tape uh, oh. for not only fucking milfs but also other you know the the women that are my age. You the, know, yes, the common they, they somehow <laughs> <laughs> the common folk. They somehow <laughs> could tell that this woman was not a milf and exposed me. For my my deepest secret, <laughs> my darkest secret. Well, that's I have nice. a question. So, do you prefer milfs because you have a huge dick and you like stretched out women? Oh my god! <laughs> is that too much? Great question. I don't know. I know. And this is pillow talk. Yes. We're allowed to yeah. be dirty here. Great question. Your dick. Tell us. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, tight, tight pussy's tight pussy. <clears throat> I think I think girth or no or no girth. Girth or no girth, I think that no matter what, you're a tight. Great tight. to have you on the show. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think I think tight is tight is tight is tight, man. I, I like I've 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 messed with. I'm trying to think of the best way to say this. Um, adult actresses who have been with the largest of of, of folks. dick, mm. um, <laughs> they can still appreciate any dick. You know what I'm saying? And I, I think I think that goes both ways. So you gave me no clues as to what I was asking, though. What I'm saying is that if you have a big dick, you, you could still fuck loose or coot or tight, and, <laughs> and, you're, and you're still going to fit. Amber wants to have sex with you and wants to know how big her dick is. 
I, I, don't, I don't think I was extremely clear there, but I, but I think that, that no matter, you know, no matter who you are, tight pussy is tight pussy. So to add to your point, I've been seeing a, a porn star, Kaylee Gunner from Los Angeles. And uh, yeah, nice girl. Yeah, thank you. I love Kaylee. Yeah. You love her, eh? Kaylee. Yeah. We love A lot you. of you have met her. Nice girl. We love Kaylee. So we're seeing each other. She's actually coming here next weekend, by the way, everyone. And uh, She's not over there? No. Oh, everyone just like, looked over there. Okay, I got you. <laughs> we're looking at the camera. And two days ago, she sends me this selfie and says, <laughs> 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 and I go, fuck, man. You know. Yeah, what's up? I'm here with my doctor. Like, what's popping? <laughs> yeah. And then she's like, no, I like it better with you. I'm like, you don't, we don't have to do this. We, why are we doing this? We're going to lie to each other? But I, apparently they, they like, you know, they like a, a normal stroke. She said it was stroke. about the mental connection. They like a normal stroke sometimes. That's right. <laughs> That's what I've been told. That's what I've been told. It's like they, they like a, a, a normal, you know, I thought you, you were like 6'3". Yeah, 6'3". Six, three, six, three, yeah. You know, yeah, yeah. like a normal... Gentle white man stroke. <laughs> Orange stars, get down with that. True that. Okay, Absolutely. Mr. Gravy, can I please show you my mom? Sure, let's get, oh, fucking let's right. get horny again. All right. What do you think? Uh, 7.8. I wasn't showing you. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. She cute. She got purple Excuse hair. You? She has purple hair. I dyed hair. her hair purple. Okay. She's trying to relive her youth. You, you caused that <laughs> word? All right. Yeah, she looks pretty. Mom, hi. <laughs> so is this what's happening now? Girls are sending their moms to you? Yes. Like every day? Yes. I mean, there, there's, a, there's a large influx in my DMs. I started on, I think, Instagram and then Reddit and then TikTok. Crazy. People just, just inputting mom picture, mom phone number, mom age, <laughs> yeah. mom horny level. Like, it's just, it's just, it's, it's not, yeah. It's, and it's, what do you do? He butters or biscuits. I I I tend to just look at it and enjoy enjoy it and move on. But but you know sometimes you know you, you got a show in a certain place and you know you shit. What's up, Deborah? Because yeah. you, you're you're doing you're launching your crazy fucking tour and it's sold out and it's been sold out for months. Mm -hmm. Crazy like Actually, big big stages by the way. Correct. correct He's not doing correct. fucking like you know you know. I don't want to stop looking at your lips. Why are you looking at me like that? You I wasn't. Fuck them. <laughs> So you want to give him a kiss? We're doing history. At the end of the show. Okay. All right, we'll get a little smooch on. You want to show him your boobs? We're doing, we're doing history. I'll do that as well. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Okay. I'm not shy. I was in the middle of hyping him up, horn dog. He was hyping me up. Holy. <laughs> history sold out. Should be lit. Yes, history in November in Toronto sold out. 2,000 people sold out in one day in June. Expensive tickets, too. Crazy. Resale, 700 Yes. <laughs> How much is resale? $700. $700 to see fucking Young Gravy. Crazy. So you're on fire. And then you're going all across North America. It's a North American tour. Mm -hmm. Right? Precisely. Okay. So you're going, and you're doing after parties. By the way, Ultraviolet is uh, talking to your manager about booking you for the after party for that, Let's by the way. It. Ultraviolet, yes. Say less. And fuck your fees, Steph. <laughs> Good for you. Good for you. Thank you. We so, ball. <laughs> yeah. we so anyways, this. my question is, so you go out to these clubs. Are you fucking all these groupies? No. <laughs> No, no, I, I, I had a phase. I had a phase. I'm 26 now. Yeah. So I, I would say I'm young, but I'm not young. You know what I'm saying? I, I think I had a, <laughs> I definitely, I've done, I've done five tours. So, so I had that, I had that phase. Yeah. You toured with Limp Bizkit. I toured with Limp Bizkit, Suicide Boys. Suicide Boys. Myself a lot. It was mostly, your favorite mostly person to tour with. Suicide Boys. Usually myself, honestly. Yeah. Well, I mean, all, almost all my shows, almost all my shows were, were headlining with, with the opener, and, and we had a great time. Um, and I got ass. I got some ass. But, 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 but I, think, I think at this point, I just, you know, I, I relaxed. I, I, I tried everything. I did my, th did my, I didn't get pegged, but, I, you know, I, I'm saying I, 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 I ran the rounds. I got with some honeys. Um, and I caught chlamydia <laughs> three yeah <laughs> caught, I caught I, I caught chlamydia thrice thrice and um and I've been I've been kind of narrowing down ever since then hell yeah I packed a couple of pills in my purse oh. I've been I've been chilling out since then you got you said you said you got the antibiotics on you 
Yeah. Oh man, she gets it every week. She got the antibiotics yeah. ready. Yeah, respect, respect. <laughs> you gotta eat food with that. Yeah. You gotta be here. Yeah. You know, I'd rather catch cl chlamydia than COVID or even a fucking cold. You gotta get something real exotic, like gonorrhea. That's when you get real freaked syphilis. up. Syphilis. You got a, a needle in the, the booty. The royal, the you've, royal STD. You've done syphilis. I haven't gotten syphilis. I'm saying you've that done. would be exotic. Anyone here had syphilis, by the way? <laughs> No one. Someone in this no room. No somebody yes. in this room has had syphilis. I guarantee. I want to know who's had syphilis. Just, you know. So, okay, so we'll go, hootie hoo later. <laughs> later, at some point in the show. So gravy, you're becoming very famous. We're talking A-list shit. So girls now they want you to blow their load in their guts, and they want to have a kid. My, with my you. load. Yeah. Yes. Sorry, yep. I All said right, theirs. Sorry. Anyways, <laughs> yeah. Had a few white claws. But they want you to blow your load up in their fucking guts and rearrange them with your semen and have your baby. So what do you do about that? You wrapping it up? Definitely not. I don't think you are. You're 26 years old. There's no chance. Well, you got so what do you do? three times. I rap when I got to rap. Definitely. Well, you've made th some mistakes, clearly. Uh, yeah, correct. <laughs> you're not wrong. You're not wrong. And that's how I've learned, you know, rapping when necessary is, you know, up to play. I think you're but just I, saying it. I don't No, I'm not saying I'm not just saying it. I do rap. And I have like you know good friends that that I can trust you know like ex you ex girlfriend it? no excuse me ex girlfriends <laughs> people that I've been with a few times that you know where there's, there are certain occasions where you don't have to rap it you know I agree with that but I do rap I wrap up raincoat <laughs> you know it just rainy it sucks though eh? it's rainy out here yeah it's not great it's almost like why even be famous you got to wrap your dick for the rest of your life <laughs> you know was it really worth it. I mean, nice hotels got good lotion. <laughs> say that. Say that. It's like, oh, we made it. Now I don't feel wetness. You can say, no, I'm just saying you can, say, you can save time and jerk off. But that, that was my point. No, I'm a, yeah. Oh, I understand. I'm a big jerk off guy. Uh, people know this. I say it on the show a lot. Uh, big VR porn guy. Have you tried VR porn? Mm -mm. It sounds like too much. You'll I'm never scared. fuck again. Exactly. Exactly <laughs> why I don't want to do it. Yeah. We don't want that. <laughs> so what kind of freaky shit do you do then when you get the lady in the bedroom? What kind of freaky shit do I do? Yeah. Well, yeah, what are you up to? I don't like wasting time. I'm not, I'm not on no handcuffs. Role play. Eh, yeah, fuck that. Let me pull you over and, you know. <laughs> yeah, nah. <laughs> We're already here. That's yeah. fucking, I ain't gonna change my name. I'm not gonna, no, fuck that. Do you go down like Charlie Brown every time? Nope. Oh. No. Oh. Uh-oh. Actually, just kidding. Yes, I do, ladies. Of course I do. Yeah. No. Oh. No. Uh -oh. no, no, I think I think it depends on, on you know, who you're with and, and the situation. But um, I'm, I'm not into the time wasting shit. You know, I'm not, I'm not about to, you know, pretend like I'm a fucking doctor or some shit. You know, I'm not going to about to start pulling out, you know, random ass terms <laughs> out of my ass. I'm, I'm chilling. <laughs> I'm a uh, fucking role play. I don't like the handcuffs. That waste time. I just, you know, the, the usual freak. freak. You, you do all three positions. And no pegging. Yeah, I do a few positions, and my, my, my ass is, <laughs> is on its own. You know, my, my ass, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? My ass is, is hanging out over here, and the pussy's over there. You know what I'm saying? Like, my ass is free. I have a 15-minute routine that I do. So we go make out, finger, down to the, the move that I do. Bang, Flatter bang, bang. Push. Respect. Yeah, and then if she does, then we get up. Once you think or she faked an orgasm or had a real one, you get up. And then if she gives a blowjob, that's great. She doesn't have to. No pressure. I'm not going to force it. But if she does, great. Missionary, girl on top, finish with doggy, 15 minutes. Game over. Respect. Thank you. Respect. Yeah. Respect. That's dude. it. That's sex. Respect, dude. That's sex. I, I, I'd say mine doesn't vary, like, vastly from that. Yeah. I'd say I'm usually, like, kind of just going to stay in my position. You know, they, they can assume the position on my face or, or you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> yeah. I'll, we'll do it. They can ride, ride you know. I'm and you know what? I say 15 minutes and everyone's like, oh, you fucking nuts. Shut up. 15, 15 is cool, It's a man. good time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you actually time it, you're like, fuck, we did a lot. You know, it's like a half a Seinfeld episode. You'd be sweating. You'd be sweating your shit out. <laughs> you know what be, I mean? If you're sweating out and she's sweating out, you, you did it. You yeah, did it. that happens yeah. to me a lot. Like, I'll be watching my show, you know, with a girl and we'll, we'll start having sex What's during. your show? Right now I'm on the new House of House of the Dragon, the new Game of Thrones. Oh, I love that yeah, it's show. Great. It's great. I fucked during that show. That's some too. weird shit to fuck to, man. <laughs> man. I, I actually can't really talk. I'll, I'll just I'll just I'll just say it, man. I, I had a threesome one time and we had I don't know why. I, I was in Georgia, so I guess it made sense, but we had Deliverance playing. 
If anyone's seen Deliverance. No, what is that, Deliverance? No one's seen Deliverance. It's a horror movie. If you've seen Deliverance, you're going to know what I'm talking about. We had Deliverance playing in the background. It's this movie about these guys that go to, go to like, a, a trip down a river in, in, in the middle of Georgia, and they get, like, raped by hillbillies. Oh, yeah. It's not the one where he's, like... That gets with, me off. With the, with, with like the banjo? Like a pig or something. With the, with the, with the banjo? Yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Squeal like a pig? Yeah. yeah. I, I, was, I was fucking, I was, my first threesome, I was fucking two girls. And, <laughs> and that movie was playing. We were at some fancy ass house. I just happened to be there, right place, right time, also wrong time. And they were playing fucking Deliverance on the TV. And I was, I remember it clearly. I was, I was clapping cheeks. Other girl was just there doing her thing on the side. And it was like, squeal like a pig. And I was like, man, I was like, oh, dude. I was just like laughing, but I was like, man, like one of them hadn't seen it and they didn't know what was going on. And I was like, yo, I didn't pick this, I swear. So yeah, so just, you know, when, when, if you're going to have a long session of intercourse, just, just pick something that makes sense. True to hot. Pick something that fits. Yeah. You know what? We're guys and we like sex and we have fun. That's no smart. one fucks more than baby girl over here. I wouldn't say that. Add it. I wouldn't say that either. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm very picky, actually, with who I fuck. So she's been the OnlyFans queen of Canada for quite some time and only recently just, started doing full... She just full... loves to flatter girls. No, it's true. Who's better? Who's bigger and better you than you? You said you don't even buy my content because it's too expensive. It's 120 bucks US. <laughs> I'm Canadian. That's like 160 It costs a lot to watch me fuck. Sorry. I can get baby girl over here for 16 <laughs> bucks and I'm good. 30 minutes. <laughs> anyway, she just started doing <laughs> pornography on it. Me? Yes. Yeah, like within the last year, but only with one person. I bought the blowjob ski mask video, by the way. That's a kitty mask? It was great. I know, yes. but now I, use, I don't use the mask anymore. Have you stunt cocked for an OnlyFans girl? I can't, I can't do that. I have hand tats and shit. <laughs> Your hands don't need to be in there. My voice, every, every, I have, everything is too recognizable. My, I have a tat right here, I have everything. I've, I've had a lot of people ask me, I, I haven't. So at the beginning of the show, you talked about a sex tape that was leaked. I actually didn't know this. Oh, oh, okay, yeah. Well, I had a sex tape that was leaked. It's, it's pretty, pretty funny, honestly. It's kind of it's kind of like <laughs> Can someone pull it, Thor? Or Producer Terry? Can it's, you guys pull it up? Can I we... try to wipe it from the internet, but it's probably out there somewhere. It, it can't be Well, hard. now it's really back. Twitter. Terry, make this a clip. Right. Make sure it goes viral. You know, put some ad money behind it. <laughs> no, I, I, I did have I did have a tape leaked not long ago because I, I was hacked a couple of years ago by some guy and and. Uh, Let me guess, your Snapchat was hacked. No, it was it was just my whole i iCloud and everything. Oh, I had to get a phone number. That's scary. Oh, and, and it was it was the only video. I, I was I'm pretty careful. It was the only video with my penis in it that was on um, my iCloud, and uh, oh. they got it. You find it? <laughs> You have it? Seriously? I can tell. Uh, Thor, you got it? I, I, I can tell. Can I you can bring tell it over, please? Can, can we? Can we yeah, yeah, it? it's yeah. fine. It's fine. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's, it's, it's pretty much gone now. It's pretty much gone now. Oh, she's hot. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best sex tape ever. Oh, I, oh okay. And no dick. Oh, there's a little dick at the beginning. <laughs> you get some trunk. You get you some look trunk. so happy. Yeah, of course oh, I'm happy. I'm in cheeks. <laughs> me. Thank you. Dude, when, when you turn it to your face, I piss myself. That's no, great. I, 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 <laughs> She's smiling. I was filming a yeah, filming a video and I, I thought it was over and I I was like, you know what, I'm done with this and I threw the phone down. And then it landed on the pillow and it was facing me. <laughs> it's like fuck it. Let me let me let me let me flex up. Let me flex up. Right. I kind of addressed myself. I was like, hey buddy. Uh, I was like. Hey, buddy. <laughs> It's, uh, it sucks because cause I feel bad for her and, you know, and it was lame that, like, I have young fans that probably saw that. But at least it was that video versus any other one, you know? It was, like, kind of wholesome overall. True. Kind of wholesome. No, that wasn't that bad at all. I have, a video, watch it. I have a video watch with Kaylee Gunner, if that leaves. With Kaylee Gunner, which is... Is with, it you the, getting the your porn, ass The Johnny eaten? Sins porn... Yes. With your legs up like yes. this? Yeah. I filmed <laughs> I it to show that. my buddies, you know? I want to see that. I'll show you. Wait, but if wait, that... If that what, what was happening when... So yeah, so she went, she went down and kept pushing my legs up. First time I ever had my ass eat. You ever had that before, by the way? Yeah, of course. Okay, so I'm up like this, <laughs> and I was like, I'm, I'm filming this. So I filmed it here, to show my boys. I up. think I showed you, Athor. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I did show you. Someone, yeah, so someone, I'm like someone, this. Someone come here, come on now. <laughs> Imagine that's the video that leaks of me. Like that's Being fucking just a loser. Consumed. Oh, yeah. no, I mean, that's a fucking loser video to get posted. It's kind of, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Because I mean, it's kind of lame, but it's kind of fire. It's yeah. like, yo. What's up? Like, <laughs> you know, you know what 
you know? I think it's kind of hard. It's cool. Yeah. You like it? It's nice. If your only video that gets leaked is you getting your ass ate, like, <laughs> fuck it. At least you're not getting pegged. I mean, that's kind of tough. <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, what do you think about the whole thing of, of Ray J, what he came out with two days ago, where he says, here's the contract that Chris Jenner made me sign to, we had to film it three times. You, you see all this? Mm -mm. You see all this? What? No, yeah, so, I didn't see so, that. so Ray J came out two days ago and he, and he shows proof, 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 proof. Full that it was on purpose. That Chris Just Jenner that paid him to, oh, I didn't like how Kim looked. Let's shoot it again. Let's do it in this hotel room in Santa Barbara. Sign, sign, sign. Yeah. Big. Well, that's a good manager. Is that real? Yeah. You so, guys saw that, right? Saw that. Yeah. So Ray J was like paid. It was all. It was yeah. Kind of and he exposes and he's like, look, here's the contract. Here's a letter that Kim wrote me. As you can see, it's her actual writing. He went crazy. Yeah. And so he was like paid to good. do it. He was, yeah. So it was like it was, was a like, it was uh, I was a Chris Jenner planned publicity it. stamp. Yes, stunt. exactly. She's she said, I want up. my daughter to be famous. The, Let's Chris go crazy. Jenner fucking snapped. Yeah. That's crazy. And <laughs> they're the ones. You know, it was on a website, KimandRay.com. Chris Jenner owned that site. And they made the money from it, which was millions and millions of dollars. Most sold sex tape of all time. And he exposed that she was the was one that got the URL than and Pamela shit. Pamela Anderson? Yeah. And Tommy Lee? Yeah, they passed wow. it. Wow. So he exposed the whole thing two days ago. Crazy. So my question to you is did you leak that tape to, to pop off? <laughs> I wish I could say I, I was that intelligent or disrespectful. If it was on purpose, his legs would be up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> If it was on purpose, I would have a whole different video. I'd be doing something crazy. Because you know what? That's a good video. Right? If I'm Young Gravy, I'm like, fuck, let's go. If I, had a per if I wanted to purposely leak a tape, it'd be insane, bro. I'd be doing fucking backflips and shit. But <laughs> no, man, it was, it, was, it was unfortunate because that girl doesn't like me anymore, and, and uh, we're not friends, and the guy, it has been two years. That was a really old video, and he dropped it. Uh, the hacker is who I'm speaking of. And yeah. I said, you know what? Wow, so a few years ago... I called, so it was during the fappening. The fappening. Come on. You're talking, about, you're talking about the. Like when, uh, you know, Jennifer Lawrence and all these people got leaked all at once. It was the best day of my life, by the way. I don't know about I the fappening. I don't know about any of this shit, dude. <laughs> I, I just jerk off to normal ago, porn, like, man. Let's go. Couldn't afford just... to buy, you know, August Lane's content like I do today. <laughs> I just jerk yeah. off to normal porn, dog. I mean, shit. Oh, man. I'm, an, I'm an OF guy. OF guy? Unlock video. Hope they're not. I call it only fishing. When they're like, watch me ride this big vibrator, and it's like them on a motorcycle that vibrates, and you're like, fuck, 50 bucks. <laughs> Only fishing. You know what that that's life is? That's a good supporter right it's there. because you like gambling. That's yeah, a respectful. Yeah, it's a gambling addict, so it's kind of like I think that's hand. fucking what it is. Yeah. Yeah. That's a respectful fan, man. That's a good friend right there. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have OnlyFans? No. How come? Because you're making a lot of Because I'm money. a rapper, and I don't want to do that. No, I know how much you wanted, how much your management told us to book your after party, and you don't need OnlyFans. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to do that, man. I, I got young fans, and and I have sex in private. True that. <laughs> kind of. So who are your fans? <laughs> Other than that one time, yeah. Who are your fans mostly? Is it is it College like, girls. College girls. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And MILFs. I mean, there are there are MILFs, yeah. But they, a lot they of times, like now they, it's they'll like pull up and they'll bring their moms. And there's a weird gap Gravy or a meet weird my mom. Gravy age meet my mom. range where it's like they will be my age and have a mom that's sort of within range. Have you had a threesome with a mom know. and a daughter? Great question. No, that's the question. Was that the question I, I you wouldn't, wanted to ask? No, no. I, yeah, no, no, but I, I forgot to ask it. I wouldn't do that. That'd go. be I weird. I would, I would really not like that. That sounds weird. Good was question. Was it incestuous? What yes. What if it was a that, stepdaughter? <laughs> So they Still fucking related. weird. I don't like that. Just like pick any other bitch <laughs> in the whole room. Like look at how look, look at us right now, dude. Why does it have to be the fucking mom? Like y'all are gonna y'all are gonna get home tomorrow and have breakfast and be like, yo, we just fucked that rapper, dude. Like that's weird. Pick anybody, you know? Okay, so gravy. That song. You you have the biggest trending TikTok song maybe ever. Every girl here is probably fucking dance to it. Damn gravy, you so bitch. You're right. Holy fuck. I, I was asked to do the dance today. They're like, oh, yo, do, do, the gra do the gravy dance. And I was like, I don't, I don't fuck. I, I, I did this, and then I did delicious, and then I did vicious. I, I didn't know what the fuck to do. I tried my best. Does any, which girl here, the TikTokers, know the dance? Don't be a coward. All y'all know it. Damn, gravy, you're so vicious. August Lanes. I don't know the dance. I made a video of me soaking in water in a shower. It's like if you're a girl and you have TikTok, you use that sound, right? Most trending sound, it's like top five ever. Or, or, or if you got a, or, or if you got a fat ass, you probably you probably dance to the d Tracy with the ass and the Honda. Right. Oh, they said, yeah, hell yeah, I did that. Yeah, I've had. You got a booty? 
I've had a couple. Nailed it. Nailed it. So it now, are you that. almost like sick of that song? Not really. Or like, fuck, it's a vibe. Let's go, champ. I've had so many songs that got like too big at one time, and I've heard them a lot. I have a song called Mr. Clean that was my first hit. Yes, I like I've that heard song. that so many fucking times now. Like I've performed it three hundred something times. I'm, I'm like, like Kanye West said, I fucking hate the song Gold Digger. But, like, I did it. He's like, I even hated making it. But I still perform it. I still do it for the fans. But now with TikTok. Damn, Grave. Like, you must be like, fuck my fuck. I don't look at TikTok, so I'm good. Oh, okay. I'm chilling. Fair. And it good. made you a lot of money. Yeah. And very famous. I, made, I actually I made. kind of got some inspiration right now. Since you're in Canada, you should do a nude photo shoot covered in poutine. <laughs> <laughs> right? Ember's the best. Amber, you're the best. Right? Are you feeling right, that? Fries right. and gravy? Yeah, yeah no, no. Oh, no, gravy. No. Yes. <laughs> you guys all got it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know what poutine is. I, I have a line in the song where I, I, know, I mentioned that's poutine. I, I mentioned poutine. You, you know, the whole song was completely different, and then and then they they made me change it because it was it was dirty. Uh, a dirty <laughs> version. And then the the writers were like, no, we don't, we don't, we're not gonna clear this. So, so that originally that that exact line was something about like, oh you're in the mob, well congrats I fucked your daughter. It was it was it was something about how like if you're in the mafia, I don't care I fucked your daughter. I, it was it, it was honestly better. I mean the poutine line is cool. No, I like the poutine line. The poutine well, I'm Canadian, cool. so yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was, I, I was really resonated love to the, with it. To the Canadians, but but I said something about roasting Italian dads. It was fucking hard. <laughs> Where are you uh, from, by the way? Minnesota. Oh. Pretty similar. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah giving, it is. It's, it's yeah. kind of like it's college there, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's giving Canada. It's giving Canada. Fuck. Yeah, Minnesota. Do you have a cottage? What? Do you not know what a cottage is? I, is that like a Canadian I know Canadian Great Britain, thing? they got those. What do they say in the, in the States? <laughs> a summer house? Yeah, a, a, the lake house. A, a lake, lake house. Yes, yeah, that's oh, what it is. Oh, in Canada, we call it a cottage. Or a supper club. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We got, we got, I don't have one. Where do you live now? You live in West I was, Hollywood? I was not rich. Uh, I live in the hills or Minnesota. I have, I have a. Do you I have like a, a sick house? I have a condo in Minneapolis and I have a relatively cool house in LA. <laughs> I never bought That's my own relatively house. relatively cool. I, I've, I've been on tour for so long, I never bought my own house. I live with a bunch of goons. Oh, you have like the Vinny Chase vibe going on. I, I live mm -hmm. with like a bunch of the homies. You, have, you got uh, your turtle and your E and your I got Johnny Jarvis. I got the boys. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. respect. It's, I love it. I fucking love it. But I, I'm, I'm going to buy my own house pretty soon. But yeah. How, like, how, how rich are you right now? You, yeah. Why do you ask everyone about their money? I don't know. <laughs> because they're much richer than me. <laughs> how rich are you? You're jelly. I'm doing, I'm doing good. He's peanut butter I'm and jelly. <laughs> <laughs> August Lanes makes more than all of us. That's a fact. No. Cap, you're on fire. <laughs> what? I'm rich than her. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how much are we doing now? You're There's definitely someone in the room that's richer than me, but I'm richer than... <laughs> I don't know about you. I'm fine with that. I don't know, but no, I wasn't pointing at you. I was pointing at him. I don't know about you. <laughs> no, we're all we're all middle class here. <laughs> we're all doing our thing. It's a pretty nice it's a pretty nice apartment or whatever the fuck you call it. Yeah, this is nice. This is the tip building during tip week, so it's a pretty big deal that we got the space. Uh, <laughs> number six comedy podcast in the world. It's a <laughs> podcast, yeah. No, we're good. Yes. Yeah. We're doing it. And I think this will be our most viewed episode. Hopefully. Because we've been going porn star, porn star, porn star, porn star, porn star, porn star. Young gravy. I'm a porn star. Apparently. Yeah, well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> go, baby. We did see the tape. Yeah. And it's fucking funny. It's cute. It's this wholesome. is a good episode. Wholesome Imagine tape. you had a manager, though, that had your back and made you redo it better. <laughs> right? Are you, was that an offer? What, 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 what you, I'll help you. By the way, that, uh, your lovely friend here, that, that's your manager? <laughs> yes. Publicist. Well, publicist, yes. Oh, you yeah, got the whole team now. We met, we met today, but it's been a good day. <laughs> Did you come up with the whole Addison Ray mom thing? Oh, I wish I did. That was just a DM. We can talk about it if you want. Okay, let's talk about that. So how, how did that come about? So uh, you're friends with Addison Ray, obviously. Yes. Okay. And you hang out with her in LA. I've seen you guys do TikToks together. No, we, are, we haven't, but I've, but I've met her. She's a good, good But girl. you have some pictures and shit together, yes. I've seen it in the press. They post it. Unless they photoshopped it together. Maybe. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I've met her. I've met her. Okay. So what happened with that? So that was like the most talked about. still is. That was on Billboard, GQ, New York Times, Cosmopolitan. 
I'm not fucking around. It was. You know this. And that is a hot fucking mom. That's a MILF. Yeah, she was. She is hot, too. That's cool. Yeah. You know, the most famous social media girl's mom. Yeah. Who's hot. Yeah. And cool. It was a good. She is really cool. It was a good pick. Yeah. Can you tell us, honestly, just, you know, I know you get asked this every day, but you're on a, you're, you're on a show now, if you don't mind. Yeah. I mean, we, um, we flirted online, Sherry and I, and uh, went on a first date, and I needed, needed a date to the um, VMAs, and felt pretty cute. I don't know. You know, it, I, I, it I like making really a... Cute. It was I great. Like, it looked yeah. really cute. Like, it's not a whole lot more than that. No bullshit, nothing, nothing crazy, no, no stunts. It was just I wanted a date, and we thought, you know, it's time to meet up and hang out. And then she came to the VMAs, and it was cute. So Addison Ray went in the press and spoke about it? Maybe. I don't know. You didn't see? No, I don't know. No one sent you that? And then her dad. Hey, by the way, the most famous girl on social media talked about you fucking her mom on <laughs> a red carpet. I, he didn't get a DM. <laughs> well, I don't look at I don't, anything that's going to annoy me. I don't look at it, so I have no idea. Fair enough. Yeah. True. I that. like that. Out of sight, out of mind. So have you and Addison Ray spoke? About yes. this? Okay. Yes. So can you tell I mean, them? not in the last week, but yes, we have. So can you tell so us? So if she, if she says something, then maybe it's more recent. I don't know. What okay. she, what'd she say? Here, I'll pull it up. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Because I, I thought we were on good, ter- on good terms. But no, no. She, she was cool that. about it, though. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I was going to say, I thought. No, she didn't shit talk you at all. Okay. And she kind of went no comment vibes. She's like, I love them both and shit. She said something like that. Okay, cool. I'll pull it up. Because I was going to yeah. say, like, we're. we're no, no. You guys are cool. Yeah. Good. Good. Everyone's happy. Yeah, I mean, I mean, someone's not happy, but <laughs> every, all the all the women in the family are happy, and <laughs> yeah, it's all good. It's all good. Well said, my friend. Yeah, man. Yo, you're a good publicist, eh? You know how to. <laughs> this guy's trained, bro. <laughs> okay, so so are you dating anyone now? Uh, fuck it on the regular without a dome. You raw what dogging was the last any part? Oh, without a... Without a condom, yeah. A dome? A say a dome. Yeah. Is that a, is that a Canadian term? <laughs> and, 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 is it? In the U.S., dome means, like, top. It's like head. Oh. Like, well, like a yeah, get me some dome. Get, uh, some but dome. we say that, eh? I wore a dome. Some dome. Because a dome is like a helmet. I don't know. Yeah, so let me get some dome. So last time... Here, here's the way to do it. Uh, last time you had sex, was it, was it raw or with a condom? Because that just kind of tells us if... Actually, it was with the condom. Okay. Good for you, babe. Okay. That's... Yeah. yeah. That is great. Yes. Yeah, yes. that's good. How about you, Amber? No condom. But it was with like my ex, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. That's great. Good. Cool. Yeah. Who who uh who was it with? Friend. Can I be your friend? So, I mean, I'm was I'm, it, I'm it, gonna it, have to use a condom, but yeah, we'll <laughs> Can you guys please have sex? <laughs> I think I feel uh, it. I'm in the middle right now. Yeah, can you switch there's, seats with me? There's a chemist. You, you had your ass ate, bro. I mean, what's up? What's, up? what's next? Man, come on, player. Can you, uh, Amber has been on the show multiple times now. Every time she's been on the show, what have you done? Shown my tits. That's right. Uh, can you rate her boobs? You always put me on the spot like this. You have nice boobs. I, I love them. So actually, one of my nipple rings fell out, and the hole healed up in three hours. I was trying to, like, poke it back through. So I only have one nipple ring right now. Okay. Right. Here we go, guys. Yep. Hold on. Wow. Holy Woo! shit. <laughs> Crazy. Thank you. I, those are great. Those are the best. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, best fakies. Awkward. <laughs> really? Really? Those are fake? <laughs> Holy shit, man. <laughs> Fucking crazy. No, you got cool tits, dude, for sure. I got cool tits? <laughs> They're good wow. fakes. Good fakes. Thank you. You're welcome. Three times. Like a, like a, you know, They're only you know, 34 like, like, like years a duck old. Call, like a decoy, like a duck call where it actually gets you with... Uh, when you're hunting and, and you, I, I don't go hunting. I'm just trying to think of a good example. You know what I'm saying? I felt bad after I said it, so I was trying to think of an excuse. Yeah. Now your tits are tight. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. I hate you, Ryan. No, they're they're tight. He likes them. Yeah. 
Thumbs up. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, man. How are we doing on time, Terry? We are at uh, 37. 37? Okay. I think we got a few more jokes left. Okay. Okay. Now he needs to tell us a really outrageous story. Right? That's not how we like to end the show. Yeah. Tell us something shocking. But you know what? He's answered everything we've asked. That's true. Yeah. But he doesn't overgo, which I respect because publicist baby girl's over there. Publicist? She's emailing publicist. Addison Ray right now. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Publicist is, is being strung into this because, because of me. Uh, yeah. She, she wants to go to bed right now. By the way, yeah. how was your vibe with her? You guys, like, you, like, you'll crack, you'll go out and just, like, do drugs together at the end of the night? Or, like, me and who? Mrs. Publicist. Oh, we just met. I don't know. We haven't even gone out for a night yet. Uh, nice he was night. joking. Okay. Yeah. 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 We're We're not yet. yeah. Not yet. <laughs> What's up? Yeah. By the way, which um, ethnicity is your favorite? Beyond white, because fuck white people. You know, I like Latinas. As I'm, I'm into Latina porn, uh, Asian porn, and then I like like Spanish, European type looking like. You know, seems like I'm sort of a <clears throat> taking a white rapper, backing him into a corner here. <laughs> um, I um, I guess my best answer is that most of my ex exes are uh, Latina. And you're Irish for sure. I'm Swiss Italian. Ooh, Italian. that's cute. What? Like Switzerland. I love Swiss. With the cheese and the washes. <laughs> with the cheese. Yeah. My dad was born there. I'm a Swiss citizen. They got great knives. Yeah. Do you like skiing? I love skiing. I used to compete. Whoa. Yeah, I used to do like tricks. Fun fact. Oh, you're a tricks guy. I used to do tricks. Skiing. Big air? Yeah, like backflips and shit. No way. In the pipe too? Not in the pipe. But big air. But big air. Yeah, we didn't have pipes in, <laughs> in Minnesota. Uh, we didn't have, but, but I was really good for Minnesota. Yeah, it was tight. Wow, that's sick. Yeah, that was like my dream. Then I was you know what? I'm not going to make money off this. So then I went and did college. and. Wrestled. Okay, you know what? I, I don't know how your career got started. Because I know you started in 2016. 2016, correct? Yeah. But how, how, it's hard to make it. You know, everyone wants to make it. You made it. How did you make it? I was helping other companies start their shit. I, I worked at a startup accelerator, so I would help, like, smart people make their company sexy. Like, I helped, like, sleep apnea machine. I actually helped this company called Eat Street, which ended up becoming Uber Eats. But Eat Street, they were like, oh, we're going to, like, deliver food to, to houses. And I was like, oh, we can make this sick. Let's, uh, I, I used to just like take companies. Wait, hold on, you t you you started Uber Eats. I mean, so not not with, not directly, not branding. directly, because it was it was different people, but but sort of because they wow. definitely were inspired by you. Hey, yeah. that's <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank, that's you, thank, the you, best. thank you, thank you. That's the most unrated fact about you. So well, so I would just help companies make it really cool. well. Yeah, fucking right. Yeah, yeah, so, true. Yeah, I precisely. I, I I was like, yo, I'm I'm I, I started a pizza company in college where we would deliver pizza to people's. Uh, drunk people, basically. Yeah. You sell drunk, pizza to drunk people. And I was good at uh, branding things. So I said, I, I'll brand myself. Wow. Exactly. And and uh, I watched like Lil Yachty blow up, Lil Pete, other artists. And I was like, these guys have a very specific brand. And I was like, oh, I could do that. Wow. And I did it. I love Lil Pete. Mm hmm. R.I.P. Yeah, so. Legendary. Wow. Fucking cool. So that's why I started with the whole like vintage art and all that shit. I didn't show my face for a couple of years. I was the like, incognito rapper. That was part of the brand. And then, uh, and then, yeah, man, I, I was like, this is, this is serious now. I'm going to reveal what I look like. And either now I, the second that I like dropped a video, I've been rapping for two years and I was like, finally had big songs. And I was like, I'm going to reveal what I look like. I'm either going to instantly fall off or blow up. This is it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They're going to either hate me or like me. And then I revealed my face, and the Mr. Clean video blew up, and that was that. Wow. That was that. That's awesome. Everyone thought yeah. I was black. Thank you. Thank yeah. You. Thank you. That was the big reason why I blew up, is all the comments were just literally, oh. Oh, people uh, thought you were a black I rapper. thought he was black, but he's white. And, and I guess that kind of helped blow it up, but. Very yeah. similar to my boy uh, Slim Shady. <laughs> your, your dog. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Your man. Wow, that's fucking cool. But yeah, it was it was it was cool, man. And I, I uh it was I, I had one semester left in college and I said, fuck it, I'm gonna do this. I like this more. Crazy. So in Minnesota though, at the time you just start a whole new brand, your friends are like, what the fuck? Right? I didn't tell anybody for like two years. Oh, you didn't even tell them it was you? Yeah, I didn't tell my friends either. No way. Yeah, I was like, this is embarrassing. Wow. Yeah. 
I wow. Like, I don't want to like push a mixtape on it. I mean, my roommates knew. But how did your mixtape get views uh, on its own? Just SoundCloud. Where did you record it? If, my if room. no one knew. In my room. But so how, how did they not know you were doing that in there? Well, my roommates did, like the two of them. Oh, uh, cool. But how did you get the first, like. It was at Wisconsin, Wisconsin, University of Wisconsin, the Badgers, the Badgers. Yeah. yeah. But how did you get your first, like, 20,000 views on a, on a SoundCloud song? Just fucking grinding online, man. Oh, like pushing it, pushing it? SoundCloud, like... DMing people, messaging. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. I, if, if you're motivated, you get there. It took a lot of time. It took a lot of effort and time. Well, Young Gravy's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> He's the best. <laughs> I, I want to fuck him more than you now, Amber. <laughs> I'll eat your ass, dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. You know what? This is probably my favorite epi ever, man. Hey, Ep- Producer Terry. Epi, man. <laughs> Good one, eh, Producer Terry? Okay. Good epi, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay, so uh, co-hosted by Amber X Emery. She got two Instagrams because she keeps getting deleted on her hot girl one. Excuse me, I got deleted once. Mm-hmm. Is you ripping your tits out in public, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It was actually because I was posting some, like, anti-vaccine stuff, but we won't go there. Well, we know how the government does. I mean, that's is. how you, you die that way, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <clears throat> There we go. So tell them your, your Instagram and OnlyFans, Amber. Um, so my OnlyFans is just, uh, well, if you go to my Instagram, at Amber X Emery, you can click on my bio, and my OnlyFans is there. Okay. And then you all know Young Gravy with the Y-U-N-G Gravy. Woo! We love yeah, them. Yeah, Young Gravy. Here at History, yeah. going on tour. Big tour coming up. Fuck yeah. Young Gravy. What a guy. Founder of Uber Eats. <laughs> Hello, talk to you next Tuesday. Yeah, there we go. Sports, baby. Let's go. Wow, what an epi. Yeah. What an epi. I'm serious about the that poutine photo shoot.